Welcome back friends with another movie reaction. Today we are watching Puss in Boots and I enjoyed the Shrek series. Puss was fantastic in them. I'm not sure if we needed a full spin-off with him but there's even a sequel coming out so it must have some love within people who watch them. I'm not going to complain about more Antonio Banderas playing a little kitty cat though and I'm sure we're going to get more of his cute little face Cracks me up every single time. Uh, not sure if this is a prequel or if it'll have other Shrek characters in it as well. Uh, I guess we'll find out momentarily. Full reactions gonna be on Patreon in the link in the description below. Leave a like, really helps the channel. Subscribe and let's get started. Is he chained to something? A cage? Was that a satisfied little kitty? <laughs> You got their name wrong. Sorry. Forever running. Searching for a way to clear my name. Clear your name. The Festival of Fire. Of the Fire. And the chicken? What? Is this a thing? Look what the cat dragged in. Oh wait, that is the cat. <laughs> This is what passes for humor. Wait. Puss out of boots. Oh. No. Oh. Didn't turn him in yet. Well, perhaps if one of us were to tell the law that you are in town, we could split the reward. Whoa. Gave him a shave. Oh. The boy's orphanage has been donated silver candlesticks. They would look very lovely in your home. I do not steal from orphans. <laughs> uh, what about Jack and Jill? Magic beans. Murderous. Do Outlaws. Do with me about magic beans. I search half my life for them. Jack and the Beanstalk is Jack and Jill? To the land of giants. And the golden goose. <laughs> golden goose. A heist like this could set you up for life. He tattooed it all over his old body. Now. Where do I find this Jack and Jill? We have no rooms. <laughs> well, I think one just opened up. Down the hill. Is it in the shape of a him? I guess so. <laughs> oh. You, you, you stop where you are. Jack, how do I ride and shoot? you. You're gonna get overheard. You, it's not me. Whoa, wait. You looking for something? <laughs> no hablo inglés. Oh, <laughs> sure. Oh. Grab some milk along the way. Oh. Nice try. Oh. Kitty bar? I saw a cow. Put up your dogs. No. <laughs> I'm getting like West Side Story vibes. Oh my god. Huh? Is this a dance fight? <laughs> Dance fight. <laughs> oh. The split. The audience is so blown away. Any chance they might get some pussy tonight? Oh god, I can't believe I just said that. I'm kind of mortified for myself. Oh. You hit me in the head with a guitar? Oh. You're a woman? Oh. <laughs> uh, wait. That's all it took to fall. I, I am a lover, not a fighter. It's been a long time, brother. Brother. What the heck? Humpty Dumpty. I have the magic beans in my grasp, and you send this very attractive devil woman to him. <laughs> you are a curse on my life. What She's Kitty Softpaws. Kitty Softpaws? You want to survive? 
you need a plan. And I've studied this job my whole life. I get the you feeling you're going to get betrayed. Okay, let's... Partners? You're going to get double-crossed, so you got to... No. Never again. What happened between you and Humpty that was so bad? <sighs> Story time! It all started a long time ago. Oh, no, 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 you really don't have to tell me your whole life story. <laughs> <laughs> Orphanage. This is why he doesn't steal from them. Oh. <laughs> oh. Humpty Alexander Dumpty. Hey, Whiskers. You're sitting in Little Boy Blue's chair. Oh, come what? On. Is this necessary? Oh, no. Even though he's gonna yoke, the egg is too up for me. Wow. What's your name? Well, I think I'll call you Sparky. Zoltar. Zoltar. How about Puss? Humpty's mind was full of imagination. He named him. Oh, when I find those magic beans, they'll grow a vine straight up into the clouds. Where a terrible and a, and a fearsome giant hoards his greatest treasure. <sighs> oh boy. This is awkward. This is kind of a, a solo dream here. Oh! This is crazy, but I am considering a partnership. Aww. I just need to know one thing. Finding them meant everything. How did this go wrong? Oh, I almost forgot the most important thing. That's me and you, Puss. I cannot wait for us to get out of here. Throw a rock. It'll make you feel better. Uh -oh. Whoa. You saved my mother. Ah. Uh. He is a hero. <laughs> oh, the jealousy. These are for you, my boy. Boots! Wear them as a symbol of honor and justice. Gracias, Comandante. Be careful of the company you keep. We are better than this. But we're partners. We are brothers. But I am not stealing anything. They're coming for me. Just get me over this wall. We gotta go. Help me up the wall. Get me up the wall. Hurry! God, hurry! What happened, dear? Oh, damn. We can finally get out of here. This is the money of the people. This is all they have. Oh. Save me. Save yourself. Ooh. Is she falling asleep? The egg betrayed me. Hey! <laughs> I think I don't want to fix the past. Please, Puss. Let me show you what our friendship meant to me. Do you trust this? I don't trust this. I will do it. Oh, that's great. Yes! <laughs> I think we got our bean club back. Bean club! Our biological clocks are a ticking, darling. You gotta start looking at the big picture. What the heck? Huh. I'm on it. Just use your claws. Be quiet. Your claws. I don't have any claws, all right? What? Sleepy big fat baby. Yeah, that was a lot easier than. You babysit. Soft paws. Crap. Crap. What? Oh. Oh, you're gonna play with it. Ready? Set. Go. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> the tooth got knocked out. He lost his hat. Oh. That bridge. There is no bridge. It flies. It freaking flies. <laughs> wow. Kitty, you're not 
not as good as they say. You're better. I will respect your privacy. One day, a really nice couple took me in, gave me milk every morning, loved me, but they took my claws. No. Oh. Cat people are crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Place the beans. <gasps> Place the beans carefully, please. Now just stand back. Doing. That's it. You know, I read somewhere that plants have feelings. So, come on, say something nice to it. Was a good plan. Oi! Air is getting real thin up here. Let's get altitude sickness. Uh, guys? Uh. Honey! You sound weird. Huh. Yeah, oh, the. It's the thin air! Come on in! I was like, what happened to. <laughs> the movie audio? <laughs> the little hat. Nope. <laughs> no. Oh, damn. Well, there it is. Giants. Oh. Brilliant or what? Huh? <laughs> What's alive here then? What, what, what was that? They call it the Great Terror. It's the monster that guards the golden goose. What the heck is it? Do not worry. I will protect you. <laughs> She's like, uh. Hide. Don't look at it. What the heck? Maybe we should have done this without him. Golden eggs. <laughs> One. Oh my god. It hatched? The golden goose. <gasps> she thinks you're one of her can't. eggs. Wait a minute. This is the goose of legend. We don't know what happens in Futanger. Yeah. Okay. We still haven't gotten a good look at it. Oh, damn. What the heck? Oh no! Ah! Uh, can't breathe. Long way down. Ah. Oh. Thanks, Ginger. To being rich. Wasn't it super heavy? Oh. I'm all about the score. Come on. Look me in the eyes and tell me all you care about is the gold. Do not fall for his animal magnetism. Stay focused. There's enough gold for everyone. Just what are you doing? Oh crap! Already? I will find you. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> San Ricardo. What do you want? What do you want? Gold? I I have gold. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ah, hello, puss. They were working. <laughs> what the heck? What is going on? They were playing. What? The 
What the heck? Out of the bag. <laughs> you were in cahoots? Oh yeah, they all work for me. What? This little adventure. Damn. Is about one thing. Revenge. I trusted you. Well, now you're finally gonna know what it feels like. You know, to trust someone and have them stab you in the back. That's what you did in the first place. Pequeño, wait. Do not fight them, please. I'm sorry, Mama. I let you down. The Golden Ghosts of Legend. Katie, not you too. <laughs> no, no, don't stop on my account. And it looks like the egg got what he wanted. Happiest day of my life was when he left, till I realized he stole my magic beans. Wait, wait, wait. He's Jack. I traded the family cow for them beans. I told him, I told him not to take the goose, but all he wanted was his revenge. That's the great terror. That's the golden goose's mama. Oh no. Crap. Oh, the eyes! The eyes! <laughs> no! Diablo Gato! Nice try. Oh! I hope you can forgive me. Apology accepted! Not you! I am here because you made me realize that there is something I care about more than gold. <laughs> This does not make us even. Oh. Freeze! Yes, it does. No, 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 no. It doesn't. <laughs> what? How he? How, what? Stop getting away, Puss in Boots. Wrong Boots. Hit it! Now we're even. Oh. I should make you into an egg salad sandwich. <sighs> that is disgusting. Why, Melda? Why the orphanage? This is our home. You mean your home? I, I never belonged here. Just got him. I'm sorry I hurt you, but do not take it out on these people. You are better than this. You've told him that before. Prove to me there is still a good egg in you. A good egg? <laughs> I'll try. Oi. <laughs> Come with me, Mama Goose. I know where your baby is. Here. And we want more than just eggs. So how about you give us that goose? Hunting. Huh? Oh. Kitty! You're gonna let go. I'm a rotten egg. I will not let you go, Humpty. I know you won't. So I won't make you choose. Wow. Whoa. I'm very sorry. <laughs> She's okay. Little baby. Humpty. Whoa. He cracked. I always knew that you were good inside. Uh, meow. A gift for you, Mama. Aww. Hmm. Today you faced the past with bravery and honor. You earned those boots. <laughs> he had such a life before he met Shrek. I will see you again. Kitty soft paws. <laughs> Sooner than you think. Oh. Ow. Uh, 
This is the story of a cat who became a hero. An outlaw dedicated to justice and a lover of beautiful women. A great, <laughs> great lover. Really? Okay. Uh, okay. Crazy. Oh, so silly. I am freaking mortified at the joke I made when Puss and Kitty were having that dance battle. Are they going to get any pussy? Oh my god. You guys could tell I could barely get the words out once it crossed my mind because it was just, I didn't want to say it, but I couldn't help myself. And yeah, I don't know who asked for a Puss in Boots spinoff, but I actually did enjoy it. I'm glad they made it. It does make me wonder where Kitty is during the events of Shrek 2 through 4. I feel like Puss is quite flirty with some of the other cats in the future. So maybe they broke up at some point. That would be kind of sad. Maybe they have an open relationship, though. That'd be healthy. Or maybe she died nine times. <laughs> uh, I just made this pretty dark. Actually, I'm curious when Puss in Boots 2 takes place. It would be interesting if it was after all the other Shrek uh, films and Kitty comes back into Puss's life for one last adventure or something like that. Uh, that would be a lot of fun. But yeah, freaking Humpty Alexander Dumpty. Of course he was up to something, but I thought the extent of it was just cutting Puss out of the score and leaving him out to dry. But no, he was behind everything all along. Like, even Jack and Jill worked for him. That's an incredibly elaborate plan. I feel like so many things could have probably gone wrong in the process of it all. And yeah, Humpty Dumpty was just so annoying. Like, I get he tried to redeem himself at the end, but... Like, making Puss an unknowing accomplice and then whining about being betrayed when Puss escapes without him? He kind of lost me with that, and the movie didn't do nearly enough to win me back over to his side by the end of the film. Like, I wasn't hoping to see him crack or anything, but I just didn't mourn him at all. And then with Jack and Jill, I actually thought they made the Jack, the Jack from Jack and Jill, and the Jack and the Beanstalk, but it turns out there was an actual Jack later on that seems like he's been in jail for the longest time, and he already went up and killed the giant, he's an old man at this point, can easily slip in and out of the shackles, but just puts them back on, reminded me of Aang, of course. And yeah, so Jack and Jill, I thought that they were siblings in the story? Like, am I making that up? Did I just assume that? Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown, and Jill came tumbling after. I'm surprised they still remember that rhyme. It's been decades since I last heard it. I guess things just really stick sometimes. But yeah, I guess they never mentioned that they were siblings. Or, so I guess they're not siblings, or there is some Lannister stuff going on, on there because they were talking about having babies and whatever. And the, the Golden Goose was just the tiniest little chick. That was really silly. Also, how does it poop gold eggs? It felt like those eggs were heavier than the baby goose itself. Has it not reached adulthood? Because its mama was like humongous. And if it's not, if it hasn't reached adulthood, how is it laying eggs? I'm not going to overthink it. I should try not to overthink it. Also, I never thought about this when I was a kid, but can those golden eggs hatch? And what would come out of them? And I'm, I'm guessing they probably can't hatch because they're so heavy, they just have to be pure solid gold through and through. Uh, we had Salma Hayek playing Kitty Softpaws. That was pretty great. I've only ever seen her in Eternals before this, I think. And then Antonio Banderas, of course, as Puss is always fantastic. I think they played off of each other really, really well. I was actually rooting for them, and it was nice to see Kitty be on, the, on his side near the end, helping him get out of jail. And Puss also used the freaking cute eyes on the guard in the first place to hypnotize him into letting him out. It actually almost worked too, but Kitty had to come in at the end and put the guard down for a nap eventually. And uh, yeah, I really liked that cat that kept being like, ooh, that was just so stupid but funny. That cat needs its own reaction channel for sure. But yeah, not too much more to talk about. I thought it was a decent movie. I think I would give it an 8. Uh, definitely looking forward to the sequel a little bit now. Should be good fun. Mindless fun. It's not like... A fantastic, fantastic film, but it was enjoyable. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Full reactions, early reactions are on Patreon and the link in the description below. Leave a like, really helps out the channel, and I'll see you guys soon with more. Bye, friends.